This will be game number two with this deck. Hey, everybody, we're gonna get into a battle. Man, this is interesting. Good luck. To... Okay. Um. Yeah, we got a four, five, six start. Just slow, but I think it's okay. Get rid of our Duder. He might have a quicker start than us, so we might just do. Um, he might have a quicker start than us, so we might just ramp up the Quake. But we'll see what happens. We'll still put our four down, but then, depending on him, if he has a bunch of dudes, we'll see what we do. Mm, an oak blood, interesting. Mm, state machine, okay. Automaton, we're gonna let that go. The decision is whether or not we come down on the field right now. I think we will. But if he's got a burn, that would suck. Hmm. Yeah, let's do it. If if he's got a burn, he's got a burn. Um, and then it goes on to our Sisters of the Baron Otter Berserker. But if we can manage to live here... Oh, that's a good combo. The Dust Runner with the State Machine. If we can get anything else right now. Oh, um... That's an interesting spot. Sorry, here's the control. Um... This is tough, for sure. Part of me wants to just sack for, oh, for scrolls, but that seems really silly. I think we pitched the Sisters of the Owl. I think, and then we Take out the gun automaton. Then we hold on to our quake. Yeah. His dust runner's just super good right now, which sucks. Because of other things, but I'm okay with him having a bunch of dust runners. <laughs> um Oh we have double quake. That changes things slightly. Um, huh. I think we still go up to six, though. I just don't know if we then quake or if we wait. I think we wait. See, that dies in what? Two turns? When a creature comes into opponent's one day, zero is destroyed. So it goes one and then zero. So, okay. So I'm less worried about that now. Um, so let's go and pitch this to draw scrolls. Interesting. Um, and then we'll put out a berserker. And we'll kill one of the dust runners. Because this is set to die on the next turn, so I'm less worried about dealing damage to it. Canonetta, okay. Oh, another Sisters of the Bear. I think we quake here. I think this is as greedy as I want to get. So we go and quake. And then uh, Quake and Pass, I think, is the play. 
Yeah, because that's dead. He's got to have a way to kill that then. Potion resistance. Oh, interesting. Oh, yeah. No, that's fine. Um, we'll pitch to draw scrolls. There's a frost scale. I was a little late. Um, I think we're we're sad about the clock library, but right now it's a potion resistance and a clock library uh, are essentially giving him three scrolls. So uh, the sister of the bear is going to take out the cannonetta. So let's push the bear back and put a great wolf on the board. Pass the turn. He is definitely more stuff in hand than us. That's a that's a thing. Death strike, okay. But not anymore. And we are definitely gonna start running away with this with all our big dudes. If we go seven, we'll probably get some sort of concession here. I can feel it in my bones. Probably not. I think that was silly. That was dumb of me, but I wanted to keep them apart, but oh well. Probably should have held on to the Champion's Ring. Oh, okay. Dust Runner. So now we gotta go back that way. Gotta go back that way. Oh, draw first. Come on, guy. Um, oh, awesome. Uh, then we'll put down a Sisters of the Bear. Playing around Thunder Surge. I don't know if we have to or not, but... This worries me more than this. Wow, so Spark, Death Strike, it's pretty good. All right, so we Mangy Wolf here. Oh. Um, we definitely go ahead and take this team out. Uh, let's go ahead and get uh, I'm still more concerned about Thunder Surge than I am about giving additional points of damage in on my Kinfolk Jarl. He's big and beefy, but you know, no reason to get cocky. Um, I think State Machine would be better than Frost Gale in this situation, so we'll just get up to two, we'll push our team back over, I don't think we'll get there in time, but I like the position that we're in, except for the fact that we didn't really get anything last turn. I like that we can spark that dust runner. Oh, that was a wonderful hit from, from him. All right, so we got to start playing bigger stuff again. We go down. That was kind of a bummer. That was a really good Hellspitter Mortar. That kept him in this game, I think, because that was pretty much pretty much where we wanted to be. Brain Lice, kind of a bummer. Oh, cool. Um, we'll pitch the Frost Gale. Put down a Duder. Put this dude in the middle. And then we'll keep a Sisters of the Bear off to the side. Ah. Yeah, we'll keep him off to the side for now and then we'll see what happens. True. Those are the big guns. Wow, he's getting really lucky with the health butter mortar. Uh, I'm going to pass on that. Uh, we'll do take that guy out finally first one and then let's put down a I really don't think you could have double thunder surge but geez I'm I'm afraid so we'll do that Puppet Soldier, okay. State Machine, okay. 
pitch. Great Wolf is back. That means we are already through the deck. Uh, we'll pass. The, we'll push this guy over. I think we have bigger dudes than he does, which is nice. But other than that, he's definitely kicking our butts. Another Thunder Surge. Harumph. Um, Siege Cracker or Storm Runner would be a good way to take out these guys. Let's pitch to get. I'd rather have, yeah, a play first. Push over. Push back. We have stuff, which is nice, but he keeps playing out. Oh, good. That makes me feel better. <laughs> Useless contraption. I don't care about. Clock library. Okay. A quake. Interesting. I think we. St what do we do here? Um, we definitely don't take out that useless contraption. Uh, I think we stop engaging over there. And then I think we pitch the state machine for the storm runner. Storm runner can kind of. It would be a way to roundabout take out puppet soldier. Oh, but so is Quake. Um, so let's let's try and draw something big again. I want to have a growth play to, this turn is what I'm trying to say. Um, so let's see. Let's do growth play like that. Um, okay. Uh, let's do between those two guys. And then we can save our spark for next turn on the clock library. And then we'll be good. Interesting. Um, hmm. We pitched the state machine, I think, at this point. <clears throat> Do we quake here, though? So we could quake here. Quake and then spark and then. Yeah, because that would kill his dudes. Mm. Yeah, I think I'm okay with the quake here. The other option would be to berserker, but I think we. Oh, let's pitch first. Let's pitch the state machine. Okay. Um. I think I still like Quick Spark. It doesn't kill our team, it kills most of his team. Yeah, we put down the. Uh, we'll save the Spark. Put down this guy over. We'll take out that guy. That was dumb. Nah, we've seen Thunder Surge a lot, so it wasn't ter a terrible idea to take to take the split away so they didn't get like super value out of it. That seemed like a strange place to Thunder Surge. Um, uh, we could Fury here, that wouldn't be bad. Uh, we could also, yeah, I think we could Fury here or we could just put down a Berserker. I think we put down a Berserker and then Fury next turn. That seems all right. So then let's pitch the Sisters of the Bear, try and get something else. Oh, interesting. Um, we don't want to play Sisters of the Owl right now, I don't think. But we could play Ragged Wolf. Let's see. Mm. 
I think we just play Berserker. And he takes a point, and we're okay with that. Yeah, I think that that's all we do. Then we pass. We just don't want to overextend at this point. Is my that's my main concern. Overextending. I probably I probably should have furied there since these guys were so close. And yeah, I'm just gonna die there. A oh, bummer. Um, let's see. Um, we could fury now though. That is a distinct possibility. Um, so we could take. Yeah. Yeah, I'm definitely playing around Thunder Surge. Um, let's see. Uh, we could stay. Yeah, Ragged Wolf would we'll take out his dude. Darg. Yeah. We spark. Oh, if we spark, we don't fury. All right, so then we. Um, there. And then we say that. And then we fury. Yeah. That seems fine. It did, that wasn't great. I was. I'm not super happy with that play, and I don't like exactly this little thunder search packet. But you do what you gotta do. Another state machine. Whew. All right. An oak blood. I think sisters that I was just not gonna come. Not gonna happen at this point. So we gotta let that go. A quake. A very interesting quake. Definitely come down oak blood. That thing's dead next turn anyway. So let's push this team over. Push this team over. And then We'll hold off on our spark again. Mm. Let's just go ahead. Yeah, we hold off on spark. Because we're not sure where we want to use it yet. Puppet soldier? That's a weird place to put puppet soldier if I was him. Oh, he's just defending. Oh, he's trying not to die. <laughs> Ooh. I'm so silly. All right, um, so then we just quake and win, I think. Yeah. Let's just quake and then win. All right. There we go. Game two. Huzzah. I have three judgments remaining. I like this deck. I think State Machine and such um, is good, good beats. I'm trying to think of Monstrosity. Like how, I'm trying to think how he wins. I guess he wins off of killing a lot of stuff, and that involves Monstrosity and the guy whose name I can't remember. Hmm. I do dig it though. Um, definitely efficient usage of resources there. Um, he looked like he definitely he got the thunder surges, and like he said, if if we probably positioned our units differently, it would have been a different game. So there we go. Thanks for watching. Until next time.